What's up, Divine Moon Goddess? Bam, bam. It's your Divine Moon Goddess coming at you with a little bit of tarot. Motherfucker tarot in the house. Motherfucker tarot in the house. Cancer's in the building. <laughs> All right, Cancer. This is my single as fuck edition. So your phone is dry. You ain't talking to nobody. Ain't nobody in them DMs. Nobody worth it in the DMs, right? Then this is for you. We're going to see what's coming towards you in April. All right. All right. It says, let go of control issues is your first card that pops out. It says, allow this situation to unfold naturally. So ca Cancer, you're going to have to stop trying to control everything and let it just, you know, fucking marinate. I don't know. All right. Let's see. What else is going on? for my cancers for the month of April. My single cancers, let's see what's going on. Express your love. It says go ahead and make the romantic gesture. Some of you guys just need to fucking do it. Get in them DMs. Get in them DMs. <laughs> All right, cancer, you deserve love. You're lovable. You might not feel that way right now because of whatever shit has happened um, to you. But no, you are. You deserve love, okay? And pay attention to red flags. The signs are cautioning you. So some of you guys do pay attention. You know what, Cancer? You love love, right? You love love, and sometimes you overlook love because other shit gets in the way. Don't overlook the fucking red flags, though, okay? Don't do it. Don't do it. All right, let's see what's coming at you. Let's see what's coming at you, Cancer, for the month of April. So let's see about these control issues. <laughs> let's see about these control issues. What's going on? Oh, <laughs> somebody's being a bitch. And it doesn't, excuse me, it doesn't matter if you're male or female. Okay? You can be a bitch either way. Um, Queen, I don't do gender. I do energy anyway. And so... We are all masculine and feminine. And so I got what it looks like is two people not on the same page. Could be an age difference. Somebody could be a little bit younger. Um, but I feel like someone's a very fucking standoffish. And the other person is just like, la, 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 la. <laughs> I'm just living life. And the other person's like, do you have fucking rules? Do you pay rent? I don't know. Do you do anything? I feel like just someone's very like off the wall, like... I'm free kind of energy and the other one is so uptight. So whoever is uptight, you need to get, get it together. Oh, wow. So when it goes to control issues, cancer and your card came out. All right. Uh, queen of cups, that's cancer energy, baby with the lover's card, my lovely twin flame divine union card and the five of swords. So there's a lot of you going through your mind, like, like really real shit one your fucking cup is closed cancer okay how the fuck do you expect love to come in when your cup is closed and then you see all those the emotion behind it's because you really want love but you're acting like i'm good i don't need love fuck love fuck love this is what you're portraying fuck love i don't need love but in reality you do interesting you got somebody coming towards you that's really like uh fun um free but with that attitude you got going on you're not going to get far all right love's card in reverse you also have someone you're separated from some of you guys got twin flame shit divine partner whatever the fuck it is for you um there's a lot of someone needs to be right here let me tell you when you need to be right there's no good ending for either party, okay? When you need to be right. Now, I do have Aries there, Sag there, uh, Gemini energy all right there in that one little pile. Um, a lot of it is there is no winners in that I need to be right. You need to listen to me. There's no fucking winners, okay? All it is is you being fucking alone and miserable. Um, so you're going to have to change some of the way some of the ways that you do things um before i even start asking justice card came out so there's a little bit of karma here that you still need to pay cancer okay um anytime i see that coming out is definitely for you some of you guys could be getting a divorce or divorced um 
but there's something about that justice card and things being unfair. So if you've been unfair to anybody, best believe what goes around comes around. So make sure it is not you. Um, when it says express your love, Cancer, this is your card. Look at you. Four of Cups. You're just meditating. You're just over here like, I'm in my zone with my chai tea. Zenny. How the fuck do you expect to get someone? Meditate, yes. But how about invite this person to meditate with you? Maybe say, hey, let's go meditate together. Let's have a meditation session. I don't fucking know. But you're not going to get love sitting there by yourself. Look, some of you guys need to close the chapter. You guys want love, but you don't want love. Which one is it? Like, um, the spirit is telling you to express your love. Go ahead and, and, and make those gestures. But you're like... No, I'll just sit here and meditate. I'll just sit and <laughs> I'll just be at home. Love is not gonna motherfucking be um um delivered like prime to your fucking house. You need to get your ass outside. Look, some of you guys are definitely separated from someone that you still want. I don't care what you say, you guys can get in my comments all you fucking want. Some of you guys are definitely definitely still paired to someone. That energy is not gone. And it has hurt you. It's hurt you. Um, some of you guys second guess is love ever going to come. Um, some of you guys are even at the point of, of, of do you even want love? Fuck love. It's that kind of energy. But you deserve love. Okay? This light is driving me crazy. Red flags. Some of you guys need to listen to your intuition. I feel this goes for people who are still on the facade of looks, okay? And what I mean by that is I'm not saying that you shouldn't be attracted to whoever you're dating because I think there are things that attract us, whether it's talk, speech, eyes, lips, ass, whatever the fuck, right? But I feel like for you cancers who are still very vain, um, and are superficial, this is where this red flags is coming into it. Because I feel like some of you guys are not going with your gut instinct or where spirit is pushing you. You, it's more with your eyes, okay? It's more with your eyes. And so you're gonna pass up some red flags over what you think is maybe beauty or society's bullshit of beauty because, you know, when you live by those terms, well, it doesn't really go far, does it? Yeah, there's an... There's an in, inability to kind of see things. You're really trapped when it comes to love. Um, cancer, you're going to have to work through this, boo. Hangman, this is not the best hangman with the Ten of Pentacles. And so even though I think at the end of the day you want that, there's there's a little bit of, of not being able to truly move, not being able to truly move forward. Um, I do feel like some of you guys got a lot of past energy here. Um, and maybe this is why you can't fully move forward, um, especially with this justice card in the reverse. I do feel like you need to finalize whatever this is because you you do have a strong partnership. And so this could have been one of those partnerships that was meant to, you know, finalize some karma from past life, things like that. But it's not over with the justice card in the reverse. So you need to finalize that so that you can have someone truly come in for you. Um, to love, you know, and be that love of your life and you have that relationship, but I feel like it's not going to come, especially with this past energy still lingering and you not listening to your intuition. Um, I feel like some of you guys could be still with ego because ego is part of our problem. Ego is what keeps us in this box, um, feeling afraid to move forward. So that's what I got for you, uh, cancers for the month of April. My single cancers, I hope that you guys work on this so that you guys can get some some love for May. <laughs> Everything you need to know about me is in the description box. As always, I send you my love and my light, light and love. Until next time, bye.